Part 3, Sentence Structure. Here we have a sentence, and under the sentence there is simple, compound, complex, and compound complex. There are four kinds of sentences in English. Sentence 1 is simple, sentence 2 is compound, sentence 3 is complex, and sentence 4 is compound complex. In this chapter, we will study simple sentences. A simple sentence is a sentence that has one subject verb pair. The word simple in simple sentence doesn't mean easy. It means one subject and verb pair. The subject in a simple sentence may be compound. My brother and I are completely different. The verb in a simple sentence may be compound. They laughed and cried at the same time. However, each sentence is a simple sentence because it has only one subject verb pair. Analyze the simple sentences in the left column and their formulas in the right column. There are many variations, but each sentence has only one subject verb pair. Let's look at sentence number one. My younger sister speaks English well. The subject, my, and the verb speaks. The formula for sentence number one is SV. Sentence number two. My mother and father speak English very well. My mother and father, two subjects, speak one verb, English very well. The formula is subject, subject, verb. Sent simple sentence number three. My mother and father speak and write English very well. In here we have two sentences, excuse me, two subjects, mother and father, and two verbs, speak, write. The formula is subject, subject, verb, verb. Simple sentence number four. My parents is the subject. The verb will retire soon. This results in the formula subject, verb. Let's look at example number five. Then they will move into a smaller apartment or live with my older brother and his family. The first subject is they. The first verb is will. The second verb is live. And the formula is subject, verb, verb. When we look for verbs, we count only main verbs. We do not count the following types of verbs. Do not count infinitive verbs. They have two before them. My grandmother wants to learn to drive. Count only once. Do not count to learn or to drive because they are infinitives. Do not count helping verbs as separate verbs. My sister will teach in exchange for cooking lessons. Count will teach as one verb, not two. Do not count the ing form as verbs when there is no be verb before it. A duck is swimming in the hotel swimming pool. Count only the first is swimming. The second swimming is not a verb. It is an adjective. Swimming is my favorite way to exercise. Count only is. In this sentence, swimming is a noun. There is no be verb before it, so it is not a verb.